Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Um, so um, this channel is predominantly gonna be about my health journey, which involves keto or a keto-like type diet. Uh, I'm not gonna be extremely strict on the keto, but I just know I wanna take the sugar out. So um, I am going to have most of the videos on that. And I kinda wanna film it day by day so that you can see my struggles, you can see what I went through, you can see my good days, my bad days, days when I gained a little weight, gain days when I lost a little weight. Um, I just want to put out everything. I want this to be a video diary as well as something that can inspire somebody that's just starting just like me. And we can do this together. You don't have to do anything by yourself. Um, I am very lucky to have a very good support system. I have a fiance who is wonderful um, and we've been together 10 years, so he's great. Um, I have a wonderful family um, that supports me in whatever I do, um, wonderful circle of friends. So I just wanna share that with everybody else because there may be somebody who doesn't have that kind of support and I definitely wanna be that support for you and let you know that you're not by yourself, um, that you don't have to do this alone. Um, we can all just help each other and we can all just work together to try to do this. So I want you to see pretty much everything. I'm gonna try to um, vlog as much as I can um, because I do wanna keep um, kind of like a record of how I'm feeling, the things that I'm going through, um, how my body is changing, all those type of things. So um, I'm just excited because I know on my vision board, I put that I want to lose 60 pounds by December. And I think that's extremely doable. I think I'm going to lose way more than that. So I just set a like a low goal, but I think I'm going to lose way more than that. Um, so um, yesterday I really started and um, I just didn't get to vlog as I wanted to. Like I was doing a lot of rushing and all that. So I didn't get to vlog everything. But yesterday I did do... Um, I ran to Walmart and got most of the things that I needed from there to kind of start my journey off. So I do have that for you guys to see. So you're going to see that. Um, and I, I think for each video, I'm going to try to put the days so you know what day I'm on. Um, so yesterday I really started. Yesterday was day one. Um, so yesterday I did the Walmart haul. And then um, I did take a picture of the scale because like I said, I was rushing. I didn't have time to do anything. But I took a picture of the uh, my weight yesterday. So that was day one. And you'll get a chance to see that number. And then now today we're on day two. And I showed my breakfast and my lunch. I was at work at the time. So I showed you guys that. And then um, that leads us to the, right now when I'm speaking. Um, so right now it's day two. It's the end of day two. I just got home from work. So for those of you that don't know, I am a teacher, so I come home tired every day, um, but I'm a teacher, so, um, and I teach eighth grade, so yeah, you know how that goes. Um, so I just wanted to kind of come on here and share my journey and kind of share how I'm feeling right now. Um, day one was fine because, and this is bad, but I was stressed about so many other things that I didn't really eat the way I wanted to. I kind of had my, um, I had eggs in the morning yesterday, um, but they were on a paper plate and I was trying to scramble to eat those. And then uh, when I got to work, I had a spinach salad. It was just spinach. And then I put some cheese in there. That was it. And I had a little ranch. Um, and that was all I ate yesterday. So I didn't even have that much to eat yesterday. Um, so that's where that is. Um, so today I kind of feel it a little bit more. Um, I had the breakfast and the lunch that I, I will be showing you guys. And I feel hungry. Like I feel like I want to eat more, but I know that's my body craving the sugar because I feel like I ate enough, but I know it wants sugar. That's, that's what it wants. It wants sugar. So um, I'm struggling with that a little bit 
because I did have to go to Walmart today and I was going through the aisles and I was like, oh, I really want something because I felt hungry, like I needed to eat. So, um, but I didn't and I'm proud of myself. So, um, yeah, that's it for right now. I have been using the bathroom more, so I've been urinating a lot. Um, and that's not necessarily because I've been drinking a whole lot of water. It's been a normal amount. Um, but I noticed even in the middle of the night last night, I was using the bathroom a lot as far as urinating. Um, so I think that's the water weight trying to come off. So that's how I'm feeling for day two. Everything else is fine. And, um, I feel great so far and I really feel motivated. I think I'm going to really stick to this. So, um, let me know what you guys think in the comments and um, I'll try to keep these as regular as possible. I will also be sprinkling in like some Dollar Tree hauls because I love Dollar Tree. So anytime I go there, I'll probably be putting that in there. I love to do hair. I love to do makeup. I love to do um, nails. I love to do all of that. So that'll be sprinkled in along with some other things. But other than that, I'm very excited to be starting this and I hope you guys are excited about starting this journey with me as well. So um, yeah, if you want to see days one and two, then you can just keep watching this video. Um, also, I am a paparazzi consultant, so I have information linked down in the description box about my website. It's fly45jewelry. Actually, no, it's fly45.com sorry fly45.com and um if you guys know about paparazzi jewelry um it's everything is five dollars and it's good quality quality it's lead and nickel free um so you can visit my website order anytime you want they have a good variety of jewelry so check them out when you get a chance um but that's my website fly45.com um, I also have links in my banner for my Instagram and my Facebook if you want to join along there. Um, but yeah, so I look forward to interacting with you guys. And this is the first video of many more to come. See you guys later. I'm so sorry I forgot to add that I did weigh myself today and the weight is 241. So the beginning weight was 243 as you saw in the picture. So um, I would say I lost about a pound, but I think it's just water, like I said. So at least something is coming off. So I'm just happy about the small things. I'm not the same weight I was before. So let's celebrate that. So yeah, just wanted to share that. All right, guys. Bye. Okay, everybody. So I wanted to show you guys what I got from the store, um, to start off my journey. So, um, and I went to Walmart to get all these things. I got a five pound bag of chicken breasts. Um, I also got a few bags of broccoli. I like them because you can steam them really quick. Um, I got some heads of lettuce, some almond milk, even though I prefer coconut milk, but um, my fiance might want to try that. So I got that. Then I got some turkey breast. Um, or turkey breast um, deli meat even though some people say the deli meat is bad you just you just have to watch like how much you eat so um, then I got some shrimp because I really love shrimp I got some more these are some more bags of broccoli um, I got these um, they're the like the sparkling water um, and so I got these for my fiance, I got the bigger one. Um, it does have aspartame in it, but, um, you know, you can pick and choose like what you want to have in your things. And, um, he likes drinking them. So I got him some of those. Um, my keto journey is not going to be super strict to the point where I'm looking at ingredients. I'm looking for aspartame. I'm looking for, no, I just really, honestly, my goal is just to cut the sugar out. So, um, I think all these things will help with that. Um, also I got, um, these containers because I like that they're separated right here in the middle. Um, and you, it comes with three and I like that they're in a different color. Um, they do have like the ones that are all black, but I like the colorful ones. So I got these 
um, in like a bluish tealish color. It's showing up blue on here, but it's like a teal. And then I got the pink ones. So the pink ones are for me and the bluer ones are for Beyonce. Um, here's another one, the cherry limeade um, sparkling water that he likes to drink. Um, and excuse me, I'm doing this on the couch because this is the only place that I had room to do it. Um, okay, then I got the sparkling ices, which I really, really love. Um, and I believe they don't have the aspartame in it. They have um, sucralose, something like that. So I like drinking these ones. It's completely zero sugar, um, zero carbs. So I like drinking these ones. Um, you can usually find these at Dollar Tree too for a dollar. They pretty much sell them everywhere for a dollar, but I got the 12 pack. I think it was like nine dollars. Um, then I got some, I got this milk because I like coconut milk and this one is the almond milk and coconut milk blend. So I want to see if I like this one. Um, I'm going to try to stay away from, um, almond milk and coconut milk altogether, but until I can wean myself off, um, I'm going to try this and see if I like it. Um, here's another bag of shrimp. I like the tail off. So I got those because we just put them in everything. I got some pork chops. I got some, you see all these are great value. Um, I got some extra sharp cheddar cheese, the block. I got the finely shredded sharp cheddar. Um, I got some celery here. Um, usually I eat that with um, the Great Value Organic Peanut Butter because I believe it only has three carbs per serving. But when I went to Walmart today, they didn't have it. Um, I think everybody's bought it all up and they're on to it now. So, but I got the celery here. Um, let me see. Oh, I have these yogurts are really good. And they only have, let's see, two grams of carbs. Three grams of carbs. I'm sorry, right there. Three grams. Um, so, and those are the ingredients. But um, I really love yogurt, and that was something I did not want to give up. But I've tried these before, and I like them. Um, and I usually put almonds in them because um, almonds are allowed with the keto type lifestyle. So, I got two, I believe I got two of these. Yeah, there's the other one right there. So I got two of these. Um, then I got some, this is for fiance. He likes the tuna. He loves tuna, so I got him some tuna. Um, here's another one of the waters and peach. Then I got me this. I kind of just threw everything just so I can get it out of the way. Um, here's some iceberg lettuce that um, fiance eats. I don't really like that because I like the spinach. So I got this for myself because I like spinach salad. Um, for some reason, the iceberg makes me itch. I don't know what it is in there, but it does. Um, I got some of these Slim Jims and I know some people think they're bad, but I got them because I like to put them in the car. And then when I have like a craving so that I don't go to like fast food, at least I have something that's, you know, not really going off but trying to you know help me to stay on so i keep these in the car just if i need a snack real quick um i don't eat these that often but um so i got those and then this barbecue sauce is really good it's um jihoo's sugar-free barbecue sauce it has uh he makes it in different flavors so i have the original it's like hickory smoked and then sweet and sweet and savory and it's different flavors but it's really really good and the thing that's great about it is the carbohydrates it's only two grams so i use this when i'm making my wings um because a regular barbecue sauce has sugar in it um but this one is really really good and i think it has pretty good ingredients if you look at that a lot of that we can pronounce um and it has sucralose as its sweetener so um, this is really good. You just have to be careful. Um, look at your serving size to make sure you're not going overboard. Um, but this is really good. So I got the barbecue sauce. And I got the 
honey mustard because I know fiance likes honey mustard. Um, and then I got, I know these are bad for you, but like I said, in a pinch so that you don't like cheat and get something else with sugar in it. Um, I did get some pork rinds. Um, these are the high and spicy ones. It's best to get the ones with no flavor, but I'm not really a fan of like hot. So I know I'm not going to eat all these like in one sitting. I'll just probably have like a few just to take the kick off, you know, from, from preventing, preventing me from getting some sweet. So I got these ones. I got two bags of these for me and fiance. I know he likes these. And these are the, a lot of people know about these, the wisps. Um, they're cheddar cheese crisps and it's the little snack pack. So it's six pouches in here. Um, and I, I bought one to put in the house and then one that I keep in my car in case I have like a snack attack and I need something, then at least I can snack on these. So, um, but that was it for my Walmart haul. So I'm gonna go ahead and start um, preparing my food. Hey guys, good morning, I'm at work, day number two. And this is my breakfast. It's just some scrambled eggs and some bacon. And I'm using my new containers that I bought at Walmart. So that's my breakfast. And then my lunch is just two pieces of pork chop, even though I think I'm only gonna eat one and maybe have the other one for dinner. Not quite sure yet, but that's my lunch and it's in these containers. And then I also brought um, a package of the wisps for a snack if I really think I need it. Um, I probably won't though. Um, and then a bottle of sparkling ice, pink grapefruit, which has zero carbs, zero calories. Um, but I am going to be drinking water all day. This is just, um, in case I really feel like I need a soda type thing, but I'm trying to stay away from it. So I opened it a little bit, but I'm going to try not to finish it because I want to really stick to water. So let's see how this goes today. All right, guys, so I hope you guys got something from that. Um, I'm proud of my progress. So the next video will be days three and four. So hopefully I'll get to see a little more weight loss. And I can kind of tell you how I feel on days three and four without any sugar. So, um, yeah, I look forward to seeing y'all again. Take care. Bye.